All right, guys, so I'm going to show you the different types of crit damage that can actually be applied. For this, we're going to take off any vulnerable. So I'm going to take off exploit. Let's exploit off. We're also going to take off in Venom. And we're going to make sure Avian Wrath is off. So no extra crit damage. We're looking at base only 132%. We're going to look for our highest hit. And then we're going to start comparing different types. So the footage is very long and I'll leave it in if you'd like to be able to see the actual damage that I've done. But uh, overall, this is without any extra damage. Uh, as you saw, I hit a 5300 there. And the max hit that I actually hit was about 5600. And that will be shown in the clip coming up. If you want to see all of my attempts, uh, this is minutes of gameplay doing the same thing over and over again, trying to get a max hit. I'll leave them at the end for you to double check my work. As you can see here, the next hit, we hit 5,600, so 5,638. That's our max hit so far without any extra crit damage uh, bonuses uh, in this video. So now we're going to take the extra 30% damage in Avian Wrath. That's just plus 30 base damage, and we're going to try that again. I really spent 30 minutes to an hour just trying different uh, attacks on different monsters, testing a bunch of things. I came to this point where I hit 6,300, and that's with that 30% from Avian Wrath. At this point, we are putting in in Venom. We're also taking one point in Toxic Claws so that they are poisoned. Uh, that way it will work. And we take off Avian Wrath. This definitely felt slow. <laughs> well, we finally came to this point where we hit just over 7,200. And we're taking that as our max hit with in Venom. So now we can assume our base attack is 5.6k. As we had 132% crit chance, we can divide that by 1.32 to assume our total base attack is 4240 approximately. Then with 30% from Avian Wrath, we'll have 162% crit chance. So we can assume our max hit is approximately 6800. We only hit 6300. Maybe it applies slightly different. However, then if we take the in Venom, if we assume our base damage of 4240 times our multiplier of crit damage, times another 30% from Invenom, then we see our max hit of 7200. Uh, and that is clear proof that this crit damage is actually another multiplier and not just added on to your crit damage. And that can give you a ton more damage that follows the bucket theory. And this extra 30% is actually another bucket than your normal crit damage. If you're going with the earth build, then go with the crash zone aspect. This is also a multiplier for crit damage. The rest of the footage is just my stock footage from the testing period on the video. So if you don't care to look through it, you can end it here. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope this helps, and I hope this helps your damage output. So let me know how it goes. Let me know if this is new to you. If not, I appreciate you anyways. Thanks for watching. See you guys later.